Hey everyone, just jumping on for a couple of minutes because there's a lot of hype in the marketplace about AI ops right now and there's a lot of people who've got some interesting ideas about what it should be. Um, the most common idea that I hear is that it's essentially a layer of AI magic that sits across everything that you've got um, in your IT um, tooling today. Um, and then make sense of all of that for you. And then we'll decrease the number of incidents you have and reduce your MTTR. Um, here's the problem with that. Imagine you are driving your car and you have a tire pressure monitor. Works pretty well on three out of four tires. You can never quite get it working on the other one. Um, doesn't always, um, kind of report when it's um, when your tires are just starting to go down but always reports when they've just totally gone down um, then your oil level light yeah that's kind of okay although it blinks on and off now and again for some random reason um, and you've got several other monitors in your car and then what you're trying to do is replace your dashboard with something that says take all the data from those things that report in different ways um, and don't always do the job perfectly and they might measure at five minute intervals and one at one minute interval and different types of data or whatever. Take that and then make sense of it and give me all the answers. You can see where I can, what the problem is here, right? You're not feeding that dashboard with great data and therefore you're asking AI to make sense of essentially a fair mess um, and come out with some solutions. It's gonna come up with some good stuff, right? Um, it will say, oh yeah, I can see your oil light is on and you've got a flat tire, don't drive your car right now. Take it to the garage, get it fixed. Um, but it's really not the answer to the problem. The problems are underneath. So when you, if you're thinking about AI ops, you really need to be thinking about what are the outcomes that you're trying to achieve firstly, you know, um, <clears throat> as a business, what do you need to move the needle on? Where are you with that data? And can you fix those data points and then um, really move the needle on things rather than just putting a mask over the top? If you want to learn more, uh, drop me a drop me a message. Let's get 15 minutes in the diary. Um, and I'd love to talk to you about how you could use it properly to really drive some great outcomes like reducing your number of incidents by 50%, for example. Thanks for watching.